If you're on here looking for the full recipe of my viral lasagna, then you're in the right place. As you probably already know, it's pretty much the same concept. I just put it together a little differently. I do a single serving, which makes it a mess-free lasagna. Now here I'll show you everything that I used, but towards the end, I'll have a screenshot with everything in a list form. Now let's get started. I boiled my noodles for about 10 minutes. I added butter, garlic, and adobo. Don't worry, I'll label everything on the screen. After I've cooked my noodles, I sprinkle some cold water because I don't want them to overcook. And now let's make our meat. I added some butter, tomato paste, garlic, and sofrito. Now for my meat, I decided to go with ground turkey and Italian sausage. I added half a cup of water, a teaspoon of garlic powder, a teaspoon of Italian seasoning, a teaspoon of sazon, and a teaspoon of fennel seeds. And I hope I said that right. I gave it a little stir. After about a minute, you'll notice the water will dry out. So at this point, I'm gonna add an entire cup of water and I'm gonna cover it, let it cook for about 20 minutes on medium high. Now for the ricotta mix that everyone kept asking about. Usually it's just parsley, ricotta cheese, and an egg. But if you wanna make it my way, then follow the list on the screen. I add cream cheese, shredded mozzarella cheese, and a little bit of salt. Set that to the side, and now the fun part, building our single lasagna. Be mindful, I didn't get it right the first time. I had to play around with it, I had to cut some of the noodles, so just have fun with it. Don't get frustrated, and if you want yours with more sauce or more cheese, whatever, more meat, then you do that. It's your kitchen. Now once I got it right, I add it to an oven tray. I do wish I had more sauce because I ran out halfway, and I like my lasagna very saucy. So when you go buying your stuff at the store, be sure to buy two jars of this sauce. At this point, I had ran out of sauce. I topped it with some cheese. I put it in the oven for about five minutes. And then I set the broil for about two minutes. I served my lasagna and I had it with some white rice, which was very strange to some people, but that's just how I grew up. So if you're not used to that, then you can just make some garlic bread. And I think that's it. Thank you for being here. This is my very first full recipe on YouTube, so I hope you enjoy it. I hope you subscribe and comment any questions. I shop at Publix, but I'm pretty sure you can find these ingredients anywhere.